More athletes have been coming forward lately talking about their struggles with mental health issues. An IU volleyball player told WTHR.com's Madison Stacy that she's become an advocate after battling her own struggles. I have value outside of being an athlete. God puts value in me and my faith um, keeps me strong in that way. And if I were to lose volleyball, I would still be a person outside of it because I didn't know how to deal with what was going on inside my head. Like so many athletes, volleyball player Kari Zumak's struggles with mental health began in high school. So when I was about like 16 or 17, I really started noticing some like changes in my, just how I process some of my thoughts. As a promising Division I athletic career saw her off to Creighton University, her mental health went unchecked. Didn't see it as an issue. She continued to struggle. And I didn't talk to anyone about it. I kept it to myself. I put a lot of pressure on just being a college athlete and just being a volleyball player. And so when that wouldn't be going well, it would deteriorate my outside life even more because I didn't know how to deal with what was going on inside my head. A crisis mode for me where um, I just lied to everyone I knew and said I was perfectly fine, like I didn't need any help, and then continued to go down a path where I made a lot of errors and mistakes, which is something that you don't have room to do as a collegiate athlete. Eventually, she had a breakthrough. Drastic things had happened, and I was like, okay, I need help. Like, please, someone, please help me. Kari sought therapy and transferred to Indiana University. Then started going to therapy, you know, got a diagnosis, started getting on the proper medication, you know, started taking those steps where I kind of um, accepted what was happening to me. Now she's become a strong mental health advocate. The machine isn't going to work if up here isn't working. Because at the end of the day, Kari's most important piece of advice is knowing that you have value outside of sports. You know, the physical things aren't just what make me whole. Please ask for help. Um, it's totally okay not to be okay, and you need to put your mental health first. And if you are struggling today with mental health issues, we've got a lot of resources for you with this story. It's all posted on WTHR.com.